Hello everyone, welcome to today's video. My name is Steven Sunday from Greater Design Consult, a leading name in construction project management. Today, we will be having a brief overview on Plan Swift software, which is a construction software used commonly by quantity surveyors. So, what is Plan Swift? Plan Swift is a powerful construction software which is used for takeoff and estimating. It allows you to perform digital takeoff of construction plans quickly and accurately. It provides a wide range of measurement tools for length, area, volume, and more. You can create and use customizable template to streamline your estimating process. And also, Plan Swift integrates seamlessly with Microsoft Excel, allowing you to transfer data easily it includes a comprehensive cost database to assist in accurate cost estimation. And finally, Plan Swift is a versatile tool that simplifies construction takeoff and estimating process. So let's quickly jump into our software as we explain how we can use Plan Swift. So the first thing you're going to do is to click on the new and then you put in your job number all right so we can just put two to one description construction of a building we click on next you could decide to add notes here we click on next and then we select our floor plan and next and then this is how we export our PDF file of architectural plan into plan Swift so you could see that we have successfully import our work into plan swift so the first thing you're seeing here is that it is not to scale here so we are going to scale this and for us to scale it so um, you can decide to click on scale maybe you can click on scale so when you do that you see this is in meters already and then we can just take any one of this let's take into in here and then we can just click four and it's okay so since we click four we can just let's zoom so that we can take this properly and then we click from this side to this side all right so with this we are good to go to begin measurement so now let's assume we're going to measure for let's say the total length of foundation When you click on linear, you click on single. Let me go down. Let me do that again. You click on single, linear. You can decide to use metric wall when you're trying to measure for wall area. You can use linear cubic meters. You can use linear volume in cubic meters. So for this, let's just use single linear. So, what we're going to do, we're going to left click this, okay, so what we're doing is we're taking So, 
just keep left clicking left click and just come here left click come here left click all right left click everywhere is properly shaded all right so at some point plant swift identify the windows that are on a plan on the floor plan so we're shading this well, all right we're done with that part left click left click and we are done so when you click here you're going to see that your total length is 337.3 meters all right so we can just decide to remove this and let's assume we're going to calculate for the footing and we don't have much information so for us to do that we can just click here and we can use this and then let's assume that the width of of, of the footing should be um, let's say 920 oh, okay 0 0.92 instead since we're already doing this in meters 0 0.92 and then the depth let's assume we're using 0 0.45 0 0.45 And then we click OK. So let's do this quickly from this point. Let's just take it this. this 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 At some points it's better you use your mouse this and press ESC when you're done here all right so assuming this is the only place this is the foundation footing this is the place in which you put foundation footing and you don't have much information in regards to that you can just come over here and then you see that so far a total cubic meters of this foundation is 20.5 cubic meters okay so thank you